Mississippi cop is arrested for shoplifting in uniform after being caught stealing a $140 pair of shoes from Dick's Sporting Goods. Robin Connor, 33, was in uniform and driving her police cruiser when she was caught stealing. These paintings are by Cy Twombly. I butchered that name. One of the most expensive contemporary artists, his paintings range from $2 million up to $75 million. And yes, this is real. I looked it up to see. This guy is an artist, and these are his paintings. And the rest of his paintings look very similar. Do you keep your money in the bank or at home? Me and my memories. Can someone update me on what's offensive today? It's hard to keep up. Everything is offensive. How can you talk if you haven't got a brain? Some people without brains do an awful lot of talking. The latest buzzword just dropped from the Devil's Den in Davos. Farming, fishing, and making money is now called ecocide. So basically, if you want to live, you're committing a crime if these people get their way. What do you mean, if they get their way? All these elites agenda has been going full speed ahead for decades and decades. <laughs> Just laugh while the world burns, guys. I don't like Don Lemming, but I'm all for whatever bankrupts the Communist News Network the fastest. ex and host Lemon to receive $24 million payout. I don't know what this was over, and I really don't care. But all the news is pretty much the same. It's just like politics. It's used to divide the people and get them to fall in line with one side or the other. All the mainstream media is used in the same way. The cashier at Starbucks watching me press no tip after they used their $50,000 liberal arts degree to make me a breakfast sandwich. This is true. Even back 20 years ago, at the place that I worked, there were multiple people that I worked with that had college degrees, and yet, they were working at the same job, at the same level, for about the same pay as I was. There is no climate crisis and increasing CO2 concentrations will benefit the world. Dr. John F. Clauser, joint recipient of the 2022 Nobel Prize in Physics. He might be a Nobel Prize winner, but used to, you would learn in third or fourth grade that plants need CO2. And the more CO2 they have, the better they grow and the more oxygen they produce. Call of Duty 2019 Call of Duty 2024 I've heard some about this and I've read comments and saw an article or two about it. Apparently Call of Duty went woke and destroyed the game. A helicopter running on fossil fuel spraying a chemical made from fossil fuels onto a wind turbine made with fossil fuels during an ice storm is awesome. And they literally burned through hundreds of gallons of fuel trying to de-ice one of these wind turbines. As destructive and inefficient as these things are, you would have thought that somebody would have thought about this and built in heaters into the blades. Even Starlink home satellite dishes have a built-in heater that automatically activates when there is snow detected on the dish. Common sense. You can't buy it. This here is just a very small example, but that is 100% correct. I have no words. Does it really surprise you guys? It doesn't me at all. More Dukes, less Kardashians. How about less? A hell of a lot of things. 
We all laughed, but Tyrone knew all along. Okay, I admit, this is the one time I've seen a car like this that was actually able to do something useful. Main school districts pulling electric buses off roads due to safety issues. Have you guys heard about this? January 30th, 2024. Electric buses are coming to a school near you. February 20th, 2024. Main school districts pulling electric buses off roads due to safety issues. Some of the issues seen include power steering failures, leaky windshields, missing rivets, and emergency doors that don't work properly. This is about as bad as those new electric city buses. It was going up a small hill, and apparently something overheated, and the whole system shut down and lost power. After it lost power, it don't have any brakes. And since they were on a small hill, it starts rolling backwards and crashes into a bunch of cars. It sent at least one person to the hospital that was in one of the vehicles it hit. Believing scary media stories. Noticing some inconsistencies. Knowing they lie all the time. Actually finding humor in their pathetic attempts to manipulate you. This is the four stages until you become awake enough to just laugh while the world burns. No bun? No problem. Just use two grilled cheese sandwiches. I'm not gonna lie. It might be one o'clock in the morning right now, but that looks pretty darn good. Can someone explain to me what went wrong? Wanna stop the riots? Mobilize the septic tank trucks. Put a pressure cannon on them and hose them down. The end. Yes, I agree with this. There's actually some farmers that has done exactly this when it interfered with them being able to actually run their farm. Or in some instances, where the so-called protesters were trespassing on the farmer's property. Why your man bun looks like to everyone else. Yes. Some of you never learned how to form a single file line in kindergarten, and it shows. This is Staff Sergeant McGuire with the U.S. Army Recruiting. I'd like to discuss the many opportunities the U.S. Army has for you. You can text or call this number with any questions you have. I look forward to hearing from you. I hate this country. If you join the U.S. Army, you will get to leave this country often. That does pretty much sum it up, on both sides for that matter. People driving alone in their cars wearing a are the reason why Pop-Tarts come with instructions. Five bucks says this guy has a mullet and a suspended license. Looks like he put that body on a chopped down semi-truck chassis. But I tell you what, it beats paying fifty to eighty thousand dollars for a new truck. So I'm certainly not gonna knock the guy. The European Union flag stands for Disastrous Open Borders Policy Bureaucrats and Banksters running everything A great future ahead When I step on the scale and it confirms I'm still a fat <coughs> Everyone always talks about the early bird But how about the early worm? How did that work out for him? Just spitting some facts here. Putting in tens of millions of 5G antenna without a single biological test of safety has got to be about the stupidest idea anyone has had in the history of the world. Dr. Martin Paul, bioscientist, Washington State University. Oh, they know exactly what it does. The only difference between government and thieves is that thieves don't pretend they're helping you. 
Very true. Hey, if a meteorite fell in Davos right now, we'd all own everything and be happy. Yeah, too bad that didn't happen a couple months ago. Records show that Christia Freeland billed thousands for limousines and taxis in Toronto, despite claims she relied on a bicycle and public transport. These politicians would never do such a thing. Keanu Reeves does all the time, but none of these parasites will. Netflix is concerned about some of its users. Someone watched the Lord of the Rings trilogy 300 times in 2018, according to Netflix. From the sound of it, they pretty much ate, slept, and watched Netflix for an entire year of their life. Your Honor, my client doesn't like jail. Rich people lawyers will say this, and it works. Of course it does. They not only own the courts, they also own the judges, and everything in between. Woke authoritarian agenda. Trudeau liberals propose life sentences for online hate speech. They also didn't define what hate speech was in these proposed bills, which means they could construe it to mean anything that they want, anytime that they use it. PETA, a fish's life is just as valuable to them as yours is to you. How come fish can eat other fish, but we can't eat fish? PETA blocked you. You're not allowed to question the narrative. You're just supposed to do and obey, with no thought process involved. When your cat is the only person in the house who believes you about the New World Order. Texas A&M University offers a class on Texas barbecue that teaches the history of barbecue, cooking methodology, flavorings and seasonings, and different types of barbecue. The class is offered in the fall and is held on Friday afternoons. Hey, this will be a whole lot more useful than most of the so-called degrees coming out of these universities and colleges these days. My parents have access to mine and my brother's bank accounts and accidentally took money out of my brother's savings instead of theirs to pay the mortgage. And now every time we tell him to do something, he says, Hey, you can't talk to me like that in my house. Here's another people of Yellowstone. Yellowstone tourist ignores rules, capturing and placing elk calf in their car. You can't make this stuff up, guys. I could literally start a new series just called the people of Yellowstone. They're almost the same thing as the people of Walmart videos that you see all over YouTube now. This is the number one recommended baby formula. 42% corn syrup, 15% soy, 11% safflower oil. A baby's diet sets the tone for its entire life. This is absolutely criminal. I agree with this 100%. People have no idea what they're feeding their babies. And to take it a step further, most of the stuff that we're eating from the stores is just as bad. So in the middle of the Civil War, someone was like, you know what this country needs? A delicious steak sauce. This is true, the Civil War didn't end until 1865. I spend weeks in the woods and don't see anything. And this dude is just chilling in someone's front yard. Where I live here, I have a couple deer that stays in the woods right behind my house. We usually see them in the valley over here, but just a couple weeks ago, we had a dozen of them just eating the grass out our front yard. Censored photos of the Sesame Street Muppets have been leaked online. 
I thought this one was kind of funny. But hey, it got you guys to click on the video. So if you're still watching this far, please consider hitting that like button. If you haven't already, please subscribe and share the video to help support the channel. When do you find a friend just as dumb as you are? Bro, I was looking for my phone with the flashlight on my phone. Where was it? My friend gave birth in her car on the way to the hospital, and her husband named the kid Carson. And if you don't think that's the best dad joke ever, get out of my face. That is a pretty good one. And he'll always get to tell the story of where his son's name came from. I think my Uber driver is in trouble. Yeah, unless he's on a ferry, he might need some help out there. Make tax collectors birds again. Now this is one that I can get behind. Being online, shopping for three hours, and then closing all the tabs and not buying anything is one of my favorite hobbies. Yeah, back in the time before the internet, this was called window shopping. You know, the very powerful and the very stupid have one thing in common. They don't alter their views to fit the facts. They alter the facts to fit their views. Doctor Who, 1977. It might have been fiction in 1977, but it's mainstream in 2024. Corporate media when it's time to scare the public with another PSYOP. Yeah, whenever they receive their new government script. This is the only Mandela effect that I've never read a good explanation for. I know what I saw. I agree with the last part, as the one on the left is correct. Although today, Fruit of the Loom claims that the Horn of Plenty never existed on their logo. However, there was one woman that searched through everything she had back from decades and finally found a shirt that actually had this correct logo. With that said, there are many examples that I have seen personally that I know for a fact were correct. And yet today, they claim that they never existed. A lot of people try to explain it away with what they call mass misremembering. But that's a bunch of garbage. There's so many of these that it could be a whole nother video series. Climate change my ass. Anybody trying to outlaw farming wants to unalive us. And that's an absolute fact. Hey California, how's the housing situation going? California homeless found living in furnished caves 20 feet below street level. Yeah. And believe it or not, from what I heard, they got evicted from their cave, too. Not a single soul has said 2024 is gonna be their year. Y'all finally learn your lesson, I see. Just when I'm losing faith in society, I see a little old lady smile and give up her seat for a pregnant man with a beard. Only in this day and hour, can there even be such a sentence? Why can't we have a normal nuclear apocalypse instead of this slow agonizing collapse? If you didn't have a choice and you had to choose one or the other, then yeah, I agree. Gone in 24 seconds. Our car was towed 24 seconds before we paid to park. The attendant told us, that happens, we owed $160. Yeah, and this is called predatory towing. Basically for this to happen, there's someone sitting in a tow truck just waiting for someone to park in a spot where they know that they can go and grab the car in seconds and pull it out of the lot before anybody could even make it up to the booth to pay. 
We don't need more cameras pointed at citizens. We need cameras pointed at politicians and unelected bureaucrats. Fun fact, Florida is the only place in the world where you can interact with wild baked potatoes in their natural habitat. That actually is a pretty good description of manatees. At least two transgender... Nope, I'm not even going to read it. I've seen enough crap today. When someone hugs me and I know they felt my holster. This is what Taylor Swift's driveway looks like. I think she sold off one of her jets now. Oh look, electric car fuel. Snow alert, expecting zero to 85 inches of snow. Starting Saturday or Sunday or Monday maybe, but probably not happening at all. Recommendations, stock up on all necessities immediately and prepare for a snow apocalypse. Or a beautiful weekend, either one is possible. This does pretty much sum up the weather forecast this time of year. If you trust the government, you obviously had a bad history teacher. They haven't taught real history in the school system for a long time. I fly all over this planet to fight climate change for you. I'm a paid chill and full of sh as some of you who done a little research may know, probably found out who her mom was and how she was raised just for such a position. Let's just say it was no accident that it just happens that she was the one chosen to give a speech at the UN and to become the face of this climate agenda. The first person to ever hear a parrot speak was probably not okay for several days. Can you imagine? Somebody had a parrot for a pet, had it for some time, they're alone in their house, and all of a sudden they hear somebody talking in the other room in the middle of the night. You see, boy, people don't want to hear your opinion. They want to hear their opinion coming out of your mouth. Oh, great, here's another one. The Pentagon's woke schools for 70,000 kids exposed. Gender expression for four-year-olds. Parent-free <laughs> chat rooms. And racial bias lessons that leave students sobbing. And how Lloyd Austin covered it up. It's a wonder stuff like this even makes news headlines anymore. Since there's so much of it happening all across the country, this specific one just happens to be talking about kids of currently serving military families. It took a while, but finally, I got all my ducks in a row. Protesters, we're heading to the rural area next and stealing from all of them. You do realize that these people argue over which lead dispenser is best to put in their truck. I'm calling the pound. Oh yeah? I'm calling the Chinese restaurant. Wanna be green? Shut off your air conditioning, turn off your phone, and go plant next year's dinner. And that's a straight up fact. You call it OCD. I call it putting the thing back where it belongs. This sums up what we've become. Our focus is on our cell phones and not the amazing world around us. Careful, snowflake. I drink coffee stronger than your feelings. Today, the dog came to our school and he stopped by my car and wouldn't move so i had to go out there and unlock it so he could search my car and it was because of the dog treats i keep in there that sounds about right my dogs would probably do something like that day shift 
relieving night shift. Night shift, relieving day shift. No time to explain, grab a cactus. When I first read that, I couldn't figure out what it was saying until I finally seen the guy actually holding a giant cactus. And I don't know what he's supposed to be doing with that. But that car that they're showing there is already gone. Being an adult is realizing $1,000 is very little money to have, but a lot to owe. Yeah, it's kind of like the old saying, a penny found is a penny earned. That's not true. A penny found is worth more than a penny earned because a penny earned is taxed. Which, a penny or any other change isn't even worth the time to pick it up these days. The only good use for a quarter is that you can use it to get a shopping cart at Aldi's. Are you feeling refreshed, energized, and ready to take on the week? No. Friend, how did you get fired again? Me. That's what they done in Congress, isn't it? Apocalypse. Having to go to work. Somehow we ended up here. When your electric powered car runs out of electricity, y'all call a gas powered tow truck to come take you to the charging station, which gets its electricity from a power plant that most likely is either fueled by gas or coal. I went out for my birthday, and I'm vegan, so they gave me a single slice of banana instead of cake. That's pretty good. No kid should ever have to sleep on the streets, written on a parking bench that was specifically designed so no one could sleep on it. I don't know if I should say hi to her, ask for an autograph, or report her to the museum. Normies. Wow, I thought you were a conspiracy theorist, but it turns out you were right all along. Me. I never wanted to be right. That is true. These apples are not real. Don't try to eat them. I can't believe I have to write this sign. You gotta expect this these days, otherwise somebody tried to sue your store. The budget breakdown of a 25 year old who makes $100,000 a year and is excellent with money. Total monthly spending, $2,775. Man, if you look at the, how they got this broke down, it's a complete joke. And if the numbers wasn't bad enough, they got a quarter of it going to donations. Florida man kidnaps scientists to make his dog immortal. I'm not saying I condone it, but I understand it. Turn around and back in to launch. They had to put up a sign at the boat ramp. Yes, and look at the trailer that's sitting right next to this sign. It's pulled in the wrong way. That's the back of the boat and trailer. My boss told me if I wanted a raise, I needed to send him a detailed list of reasons why I think I deserve one. So I just dropped this off on his desk. And we'll end the video with this. Life is short. Break the rules. Forgive quickly. Kiss slowly. Love truly. Laugh uncontrollably. And never regret anything that makes you smile. R.I.P. Toby Keith. Click on one of the videos above to help support the channel. Please hit that like button and subscribe. I thank you all for watching. This is Acorn, over and out.